are leaving Tirana today after a very intense weekend. Very a weekend we will never forget. And we have a reason to come back. And now we go uh, towards the countryside, the rural areas, the seaside. Back to the basics, back to the wild camp again. Back to nature. Back to nature. And um, well, we're going to the south southern part of Sodanda, near Sodanda, where we. Uh, that was the first city we entered last year, and which left the impression on us. And we're still impressed by Albania. It haven't let down so far. It's only been an amazing time. So uh, all the tourists, and go people, here. go to Albania, experience this wonderful country, the nice people, and uh, we'll, 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 we will report more. Finally, we see the sea. Our clothes at the hotel, but we didn't had time to uh, dry it. So uh, today we drove all day, and we hung the laundry in the car, and now it's dry. 
So tomorrow we can have some clean clothes again. A very, very good alternative to a normal washing line. Good morning, my friends. We woke up really early today. We're gonna ride some, explore the nature of uh, Albania with ATV Albania. Wherever Sander goes, he makes his hands dirty. <laughs> Now we are trying to, he's trying to uh, modify the quad so it can go a little bit faster. Finally had a chance to modify the car. It looks dope, doesn't it? Completely different car. I think it also adds some uh, sheep power. Maybe 10 sheep power, 20 sheep power. It's a badass machine, man. Okay, down is already like this. I don't want to think of going up so maybe we should just roll ourselves here and, and see where we end up so uh, we've been going on a hike because we wanted to go uh, to a deserted beach but uh, the hike is a bit too uh, extreme. too extreme we're not experienced enough for this man can't this yeah, he's on flip flops. I'm on water shoes. Not perfect uh, stuff. At least we got enough food with us. But uh, we go back because uh, we don't want to get in trouble. It's very steep and uh, overgrown. We finally made it back to the car. I'm never doing this again. You never leave the car again. Never will I visit Albania again in high season. <laughs> but we made it. Woohoo! I have never been so happy to see it or no. Ooh, what do we have here, guys? We're gonna add some horsepower to the to the sheep, and, uh, the sheep in wolf's clothing. <laughs> Of, uh, the wolf the in sheep's clothing, yeah, yeah, that's and it. the baguette. <laughs> a bit of horsepower for the mountains. We already have one sticker, so that's an extra 25 horsepower, I think. That's right, yeah, right? Yeah, 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 yeah 25. It's a drag race. We already competed. Mm -hmm. If you just put a sticker, it's 10, but if you compete, it's 20. Ah. Right. My God, Sharon, I didn't know you were a professional fuck up. What the fuck are you doing, man? It's just a sticker. We want it to be a bit nice today. The raccoon's nest. The raccoon's nest indeed. 
Ooh. Wait, wait, and there's more. Even more. Yeah, the smallest with the highest horsepower. Oh. Is that a Supra? <laughs> we'll never know. So. Maybe when we open the bonnet. Just put it on the bonnet and when you open it. <laughs> okay, where are we gonna put it? Here or here? Yeah, put it there. But make it kind of center. Yeah, it seems about right. Hmm? It seems about right. I swear to God, this cola smells like goat cheese. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, don't sniff it too much, man. Why not? <laughs> you still gotta drive. <laughs> so here we have 1000 horsepower. 25 horsepower and another 25 horsepower on top of the 100 horsepower it already has. 116 man. 116. This is a real. Helcon, you get it back. Watch out with the gas, man. I yeah. don't need the LPG, <laughs> but the throttle because you might have some power, man. Yeah, this thing is going places. <laughs> Look at this 